Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Mosaic Football four box cello pack break. It's not a single cello pack, it's four boxes of those cello packs. It's where those packs are born. Uh, random team number one. One spot gets you two teams right here, but before we do that, there was an early bird special. If you're one of the, one of the first ten to buy spots in this, you, get a, you have a chance at an extra spot. So let's go to the early bird section here. So let's grab your 10 names, put them into a new list. And the name on top, after six times, will get an extra spot in this break. One, two, three, four, five, and six and final time. After six, it's Anthony. Anthony Peretti, after six times, you are the early bird that catches the worm. Mix here with, uh, oh, with the case. Oh, it's from a fresh case too, ladies and gentlemen. All right, now let's grab all 16 names here. There's everybody here. And then we'll double you up because one spot gets you two teams. And we'll roll it and randomize it with all 32 teams. No combos. Let's roll it and randomize both lists. One and a four, five times for each list. We've got World Series game four right here going on too, folks. One and a four, five times. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five, we've got Oliver down to Matt. Let's straight to the... All right, four and a one, one and a four, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and a one. After five times, we've got the Jacksonville Jaguars all the way down to the Minnesota Vikings. <laughs> Jet, I did know that, that Mike Yastrzemski is a little on the older side, a late bloomer. So is Ariza Reina, he's the most one I've ever. How old is Ariza Reina? 28? 25. He's 25. Well, Mike Shimsey's 30 for like his second. That's like Jeff. Yeah. yeah. Hey, it took a while, but he's here. He's actually a pretty decent player. Want to pick a stack and start with them? Are they all stacks of four? Yeah. Okay, so we'll go one, two, three, four, five. Want to do one more time? One, two, three, four, five. We'll use that Dodger blue die right there, and it's five. One, two, three, four, five. These are the four we're going to do. Right here. The next is posted. Next one's posted, too. We can run this back tonight if you want to. All right, so we'll leave those back there. And here are the four that we picked right here. Nick will get into that. Let's go back to this. Um, there you go, yeah. All right, so Oliver with the Jags, Matt Lieber with the Patriots. Mike with the Bears, Oliver with the Colts, Chris Parent with the Bengals, and the Browns. Adam, you got the Ravens, Matt with the Bills, Adam with the Steelers, Anthony with your early bird spot, the New York Football Giants. Adam with the Saints, Chris with the Panthers, uh, Almeida with the Packers, Matt with the Buccaneers, and the Dolphins. Double last spot mojo, chance at the Finns as well, chance at maybe some TVs for TV. Almeida with the Rams, Jimmy with the Niners, Adam with my Raiders. Matt with the Chargers and the Broncos. Mike with the Bron Broncos. Ma Mike with the Dallas Cowboys. Anthony, your other early bird spot, Falcons. Keanu with the Texans. Anthony with the Washington football team. Matt with New York Jets. Christopher with the Cardinals. Adam with the Lions. Anthony with the Chiefs. Adam with the Seahawks. Kike Hernandez with a hit. Rip down the left field line. Playoff Kike coming through. Jimmy with the Titans, Keanu with the Eagles, and Matt Lieber with the Minnesota Vikings. Mike Krasinski has the uh, Bears up for trade if anybody's interested in Chi-Town. Texans and Eagles are up for trade as well. So there's Mike and the Bears. I know it's kind of hard to see, but 
if you need me to call out a team or a name or something like that, let me know. Texans and Eagles are up, also up for trade. Here's Keanu with the Texans and the Eagles. Bears for Eagles, maybe? I got, a, I got a box right here on my table as well, FYI. Michael counters, counters with the Bears for Eagles, perhaps. Keanu counters that with Bears for Texans. No on the Texans. All right, then let's roll. All right, some trade chatter there, but no deals were done. It's all good. TWC, trade window closed. Trades don't have to happen all the time. All right, all right. I like that extra one. Today? today? I know. I think I guessed I went with two, didn't I? No, you went with like five plus. Oh, maybe I did win five plus. I forget. I don't know. I don't think we're winning twenty five thousand dollars today. Alright, here's the final printout right here, folks. Thanks for watching. The next four box of this stuff in the store right now. So these have the exclusive um, pink camo refractors, which are pretty cool. Very similar to the basketball. Wouldn't you be like, get off my driving range? Get that film crew off my driving range. Actually, I'm sure that's happened a lot. And they, this is the only stuff that they kept. Target near my house opens tomorrow. I gotta look for. I gotta see if I could find myself some uh, some of this, some of this, some trading cards, Pokemon cards. Maybe maybe some prison prison blasters. They have like cards stocked for uh, <laughs> for their grand opening. A lot of them are putting it down because it's getting so violent. What's getting violent? The hunt for trading cards? Yeah, there's lines. Wow. There's uh, there was a uh, fight between the, the person who stocked it and one of the flippers. Wow. I think it got like physical. They were just like, so hey. A lot of Walmarts are saying we're not carrying sports cards anymore. Because that's. Because they don't really profit off of it. Yeah, they don't profit off of it, so it's just a hassle. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, a nightmare. Mm -hmm. Alright, well. Visit your local hobby shop. Support your local hobby shop. We're in Hermosa Beach. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Jaspies.com.
Good luck. Here we go. Short franchise history? How long has it been? I don't know. 20 years? 25 years? 30 years. Is that short? I mean, compared to the Dodgers, they've been around for like over 100 years. Yeah. But it's not like Nationals. They're not the shortest. Right, right, right. Yeah, I don't know what Joe Buck's point was there. He's ripping the You think it just looks like grapefruits up there? Just like big, juicy grapefruits just cool. going? That, that must be the coolest feeling. To see a baseball that big no and just there. moving at 60 miles per hour. And everything just slows down. There's Clyde Edwards Elaire. Anthony. Mariota. Back off the IR, I think. There's our first Joe Burrow. NFL debut, Joe Burrow. And that goes to Chris Parent, who got this randomized to him. I wrote pick your team on this. This is a random team break, folks. Sorry, my bad. Look at the teams again, once again. So obviously, these are the vet commons. These won't ship. That will ship because that's a green parallel. Those aren't numbered. That's how I'm kind of breezing by those. Inserts obviously will ship. And then rookies, of course, will ship. If you're not familiar with it, that'll ship, that'll ship. And I'll sleeve up rookie parallels, but all the base rookies, of course, will ship. You know, Tyler Boyd will ship. Everything in these bonus packs will ship. All right, Jet, what's up? Justin Herbert secretly the person who hurt Tyrod? I mean, I don't think so, but I'm sure there's some conspiracy theories out there that somehow Justin Herbert and his, and his agent... Uh, maybe orchestrated this whole medical mishap. Chances are it was just an accident. I mean, probably was an accident. But what did they say? The most, the simplest answer tends to be the most, uh, some, someone's razor. Simplest answer is usually the right answer. Clyde Edwards E. Lair, NFL debut. Chiefs, Anthony. Ooh, look at this. Adam Thielen, Genesis. Yeah, Occam's Razor. I think there's a K in there somewhere. I don't know how to spell it either. There's a K in there somewhere. There's Adam Thielen, Genesis. That's a super short print. SSP for the Vikings. That'll be for Matt Lieber. Green DeAndre Swift for uh, Adam Kupperman and the Lions. Well, Michael P. Ryan Green for the Jets. Will he get more run out there without Le'Veon Bell on that team? Maybe. We'll see this weekend. Come on, G-Man. An NFL debut to a tag of Viola Silver. That is for Matt Lieber. Got that randomized to him with his last spot mojo spot. Thankfully, I had a top loaded first. There's CD Lamb. Mosaic for the Cowboys. Mike Grzynski with that one. I think they call it the mosaic pattern. Bonus packs. Pink camos. So Kevin is there tonight? I, I don't think he's there tonight. I think he's traveling. Well, no. I think he left on Friday, yesterday. Hey, was he at work yesterday? Yeah, yesterday was... No. So I, yes. Yesterday was. was Friday. He yes. was. So I think he left today. I think he's looking for Monday, tickets for game Sunday or the Monday, Tuesday game. If necessary. If necessary. Yeah. Aster <laughs> the little asterisk, if, if necessary. necessary. Idea 
check the front seat. No, Sorry. What are you guys getting? Jay Cano 89 hello, welcome. Nice. I hope so too. I hope so too. We've got we've got time to do it, that's for sure. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. That's a that's a lot of fun. We just have to do those two quick number block randomizers and then we're in break sale on that. So all of these pink camels are parallel, so even if they're their vet commons or retired players, I'll definitely ship. That's good. Okay. Bye, Jackie. Right. You're, not, huh? you're coming in Tuesday? Next? No. Tomorrow? No. Okay. I'll see you then. Wow, this, my schedules are all screwed up in my head. It's like, when's Kevin coming in? I don't know. <laughs> He's at the. I know. I, I don't know if he's at the game tonight. Maybe tomorrow. I think he was supposed to win like four hours before the game today. But I don't know if he's actually at the game. Huh? How many tickets are they selling? 10,000? I believe his tickets on my desk until you know it's done. Okay, thanks. Can't be that much. Oh, wow. I thought that was fun. Yeah, I thought, like, <laughs> where'd that go? <laughs> But like nobody reacted, no, so that looked weird. weird. Yeah, I thought they were just shocked. Right, so this is a full box, and the corresponding pink camos right here. All right, RTR, what's going on, real time? Oh, that ghost is terrifying. Ghost emoji. Easy with that. We're trying to break here. There's, I might be like, I might spill a bunch of cards. Two attack of Viola, NFL debut. Matt Lieber with the Dolphins. Isaiah Simmons Green. Stefan Diggs Silver. Am I missing any big uh, NFL news? The the eve of the NFL Sunday of another NFL week. Uh, have I missed any big news? Bills is Kevin Knox test positive and three other tight ends for the Buffalo gets. Wow, Raiders activate the four offensive linemen who had contact with Trent Brown. I don't know if Trent Brown's playing. I think Jonathan Abrams not in. This is going to be weird. How am I supposed to bet on sports with all this? Or Dawson Knox. Why did I say Kevin Knox is a basketball player? Um, yeah, Nick told me about the, the Daniel Jones and Saquon Barkley hanging out maskless out in public. Oh, what? Yes, Logan, triple threads will break tonight. So hopefully everyone buys spots. We've got about... I don't know, hour and 15 minutes left in the show. That's plenty of time to fill that triple thirds. NFL debut mosaic pattern for Chris Parent and the Bengals. Browns at Bengals. Who does everyone have there? Browns are minus three. Home favorite or road favorites. I kind of like the short home dog. 
Or cat, if you will. This will also go to you as well, Chris Parent. Jet's asking, is Jake Fromm even going to play ever? Like, what's the point of having him? Well, it's kind of smart to have an extra quarterback in case someone gets injured. There's a Tua right there. And guess what? If Jake Fromm marinates behind Josh Allen and does well, you can trade him for assets, draft picks. There's two attack of Viola. Some teams prefer the the younger backup to a younger quarterback. So they can kind of grow together in the locker room. In the QB meeting room. I think that's important. Jonathan Taylor NFL debut. Yeah, the Packers, well, if 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 Aaron Rodgers keeps playing like he did last week, Logan, they'll definitely gonna need this kid to come up sooner rather than later. How quickly Packers fans forget about last week. That's what happens when the Packers face a decent defense. That's gonna be dang, that's not gonna be good for them play their playoffs hopes. It was Rodgers' fault? Get him out. It wasn't Rodgers' fault. Rodgers could do no wrong. Getting coaches fired. Never his fault. It's always the fault. Joe Burrow, pink camo, NFL debut. Bengals, Chris Parent. Clyde Edwards Elair, pink camo. Chiefs, Anthony Peretti. We got a nice Jonathan Taylor. Jalen Hurts might get a little bit of action. Brad is wary of uh, Seahawks Cardinals. Seattle plays well in prime time, but Arizona has been playing played as well as division rival. Yeah, what's the what, what's the line on that? Yeah, Seahawks also road favorites. Seahawks minus three and a half. Um, Christian, for the random number blocks, you think I have a good chance of getting something or is it like hit or miss? Every single thing on jazbeescasebreaks.com is hit or miss. There's a Justin Herbert right there. But you can't win if you don't play. And a lot of people, a lot of people play in that triple threads. There must be a reason why. Because the chase is worth it. Here's our first Justin Herbert from Matt Lieber and the Chargers. Come on, Pedro Baez. Pedro Baez. Why does Dave Roberts keep going to that guy? Good changeups that he threw in that at bat. 
The NFL debut, Justin Herbert. Matt Lieber with the Chargers. He does, Nick Galvin. I mean, he's fine in the regular season, but he but every postseason, they, they, the Dodgers want to, Dave Roberts and the team wants to keep putting him into these high leverage situations. And we've seen the story so many times. This was just once or twice. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't really say too much, but but it seems like it's just it has happened so many times before, and yet they keep doing it. NFL debut Green Bengals Chris Parent. Right, he's consistent in the wrong way, yeah. He consistently does this in the playoffs. Which is odd, because regular season, it seems like... I mean, I know you're not facing, you know, the, the best teams. You know, you're not facing a team like the Rays every time he's out there, but... It's just odd that he just does so well in the regular season, but something something in his head in the postseason just gets him and... He shouldn't be put in that position anyway. I mean, both, both Roberts. Why is he putting him in? You know, why is he putting him uh, in positions like this? And why is Pedro is not thriving in positions like this? It's a little bit of both. No, there's a lot of baseball left. What Dodgers have at the top of the seventh, eighth, and ninth. Yeah, there we got about three innings left, but still. Chase Young Silver for the Washington football team. That's for Anthony. Oh, they can strike out this guy, though. Clyde Edwards E. Lair, pink camo. Jalen Hurts. NFL debut, Clyde Edwards-Hilaire, pink camo. NFL debut, pink camo, Joe Burrow. Well, C.D. Lamb is a rookie. Jalen Hurts, NFL debut. Antonio Gibson. And LaVisca Chenault Jr. for the Jaguars. That'll be for Oliver Soria. Antonio Gibson for Anthony. And the Redskins, Jalen Hurts with... Uh, going to Keanu and the Eagles. C.D. Lamb going to uh, Mike G. And the Dallas Cowboys. And another Jalen Hurts right here for Philadelphia. Keanu. There's NFL debut, Joe Burrow. Chris Parent with the Bengals. All these add up. So do these. NFL debut, Clyde edwards Lair, Anthony. Is he still the leading? I think he is. I don't know who else it would be. Who is, he's the leading rookie rusher. He's been playing pretty well, if, especially if especially if Kansas City starts leaning more towards the run. Which is what I, what I read somewhere in an article, that, that defenses were playing further back, right? Like these are your, your secondary. They're playing further back, right? Because they don't want to get beat by Mahomes throwing. So then it's guys like this who could. Maybe get there. Maybe get to where they need to be. Alright, here is the final cello box. And we've got another four box break of this in the store if you want to. If you feel like doing another one of these, ladies and gentlemen. We are running out of time, though, folks. We don't have too much time left. And there's no no late night tonight. We had a couple late, a few a few late nights this week. 
but no late night tonight. Just be normal hours today. So if you want to make something happen, make it happen now. We've got to start moving breaks now on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Joe Burrow Green, Chris Parent, Bengals. You've got to grade some of these too, Chris. I think that would be a good idea. NFL debut, Silver, Jacob Eason. Maybe this was the game where I should have bet, will there be extra innings? Yes. <laughs> Jacob Eason, Silver goes to Oliver Soria and the Colts. There's LaMichael P. Ryan. Maybe he gets a little more action this week. We need some bright spots for the Jets. I think this guy could be the one to deliver. I think Denzel Mims is coming out. Ooh, there you go, Corey Seager. Lead off hit. Brian Edwards out another week, by the way. Ruggs is healthy, though. That offensive line. Tig, what's going on? How are you? Maybe this guy will come back too, Denzel Mims. Kenneth Murray, rookie. Ooh, Denzel Mims is, is appearing tomorrow. Okay, all right. Adam Kupperman with the Jets report. That's his team. All right, so let's let's see a lot of. Uh, I want Sam Darnold slinging it around. I want Denzel Mims with some catches, maybe a TD, or at least one ESPN highlight type play. I want them grinding it out with Lamichael P. Ryan. That'd be hashtag good for the hobby. I mean, Chase Claypool kind of came out of nowhere, right? And Darnold will play tomorrow. So his his wing, I think he had a, he had a busted wing. I think his wing is okay now. I think the Jets are Jets are plus ten. I think they were plus thirteen at some point. People on the Jets. That could be interesting. I mean, at some point the players themselves just have to say "f it" and just start like. Really take imagine in their own hands, start grinding it out. DeAndre Swift, rookie. Henry Ruggs. Clyde Edwards Elaire. Joe Burrow. Yeah, it was at thirteen at one point, right? I think the bill you had to lay thirteen points or something like that with the Bills. But maybe like maybe the public thought that's just way too much. <laughs> You got to make Jets 14 points. Maybe you have to take that just on principle. Oh, let me just do the rest of these. Nice, Justin Turner. Wow, Turner with the wheels. I guess his hamstring's okay. All right, there's Clyde Edwards Elaire pink camo for the Chiefs. A lot, lot of lot of these pink camos do really nicely on the secondary market. NFL debut Joe Burrow. I don't know. Bills had a rough day at the office the other week though, right? They're not perfect. It's Joe Burrow. Maybe there's pride. Joe Burrow, uh, Chris Parent, Bengals. Adam's like, if 13 sounds like too much, then you haven't watched the Jets this season. No, but. What's the score? Denzel Mims, uh, it's 5-3. 5-4. They just scored a run. I don't know. The market is moving. Why is the market moving? I 
Other people might be thinking the same thing. Wait, do I have, do I have any? I don't know if I'm logged into that particular thing or not. Do I have numbers for you? I don't know why it moved. 39% of the bets are on, uh, of actual bets placed is on the Jets, but only 29% of the money is on the Jets. You know, so that's, that's interesting. But yeah, all the books have moved to 10. It's kind of interesting. Yeah, maybe Darnold's coming back is a few points. Oh yeah, I mean I don't I don't think. Come on, Jet, we're not crazy. I don't know I don't I don't think the Jets are gonna are gonna win. But if you're giving the Jets a touchdown and a field goal head start, <laughs> you start to think. All right, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry for being a little distracted by the baseball game here, but it is the World Series. But uh, a very nice break. Pretty solid stuff. A lot of great rookie parallels that are going to be top loader for you too. Some Joe Burrows, some Clyde Edwards Hilaires, some Justin Herberts. That Genesis Adam Thielen was pretty cool. So a lot of great stuff. Uh, you know, there's more than just this. There's all these other great rookies too. So big thanks to everybody who got into the action. We got more of this in the store if you want to keep chasing these uh, pink camo parallels and whatnot and Genesis and stuff. Thanks everybody. I'll see you next time for the next break. Go Dodgers.